Good evening. Can everyone hear me okay? Yeah? Great. In just a few minutes, the ceremony will begin, and we ask that the audience remain seated during the processional. Following the ceremony for your convenience and a faster exit, you will be able to exit from behind the stage. There's a bank of doors on both the north and south side if you want to exit faster. And if you need assistance, we have plenty of staff available to help you with it. Thank you.
evening, ladies and gentlemen. Would the audience please stand as the UNC Police Department Honor Guard approaches the stage for the presentation of colors and while Michael Kilcoyne leads us in singing our national anthem. Thank you, and please be seated. Welcome to the University of Northern Colorado's graduate commencement ceremony. My name is Vish Iyer, and I will be your host for tonight's ceremony. Our student farewell address this evening will be given by Lauren Wasser. Lauren will be receiving her Master of Arts in Theater Education. Lauren? Hello. Everybody. It's nice to see you all. Um, my name, again, is Lauren Wasser, and I am honored to be here to welcome the dignified staff, the supportive family and friends, and the most honorable of graduates. Um, my musings tonight can be best embodied in a quote by Dan Zadra, and this quote is near and dear to my heart. It was one that my choir director read to me many years ago, and one that I read to every single one of my theater students today. Someone saw something in you once. That's partly why you are here today. Whoever it was had the wisdom and the foresight to see your potential, to bet on your future, to catch hold of your dream. The quote goes on, but my musings tonight are on these first few lines. Our paths to graduate school are wildly different, and our future paths are even more varied. But we have all been lucky enough to have at least one positive person in our lives. This person may be a parent, a partner, a friend, a mentor, a colleague, a professor, and the list goes on. If fortunate enough, it may be all of the above. 
What's beautiful, however, is that we have, all of us have had at least one person that has seen our potential and helped us guide us to our potential, has had someone lift us up and encourage us to push through seemingly impossible obstacles, and has had someone help us to catch hold of our dreams and succeed. Take a moment and think of that person, of those people. Well, graduate class of 2019, we have succeeded. We are here today because of our own fortitude and because of those people in our lives who never let us stop dreaming and striving for better. Some of us sitting here are teachers, some are professors, some are nurses, dance instructors, chemists, accountants, interpreters, and the list goes on. No matter our occupation, though, it's your time to be that someone for another. It's time to lift someone up who desperately needs support. It's time to believe in someone else's dream. As the quote continues, Zadra says that all human progress has been the story of someone who believed passionately in something and someone who believed passionately in that person. You have had someone believe in your passion and helped you follow it, and that is why you are here. Do that for another. Believe in them passionately, fiercely, selflessly. I would be remiss not to thank those in my life who believed in me passionately, fiercely, and selflessly. My awesome parents and sisters who are watching on the live stream, hello. My hilarious husband, my dear friends, my genius graduate professors, and then some of the best people I've ever met, my UNCO Cohort X family, who have shaped me into the artist and the person I am here today. In a world of tumult, this cycle of passionate belief is what keeps us moving forward. The people you guide will then guide others, and years from now, there may be someone sitting in your exact same seat that is a direct positive consequence of your selfless choice. And that is the beauty of belief. Its possibilities are endless and its consequence is far reaching. As you leave here tonight, be sure to thank those who believed in you. But more importantly, start seeking out those who need you. Dan Zadra ends his message the same way I will tonight. Here's to your heart, your dream, and the difference you make. And I mean this sincerely. Here's to all of your hearts that house your passion and your dreams that have prompted you to seek more. And most importantly, here is to the difference you have made and you will make in the world. Thank you. It is now my distinct pleasure to introduce to you the president of the University of Northern Colorado, Dr. Andy Feinstein. Well, thank you, Dr. Iyer, and good evening, graduates and guests. Buenas noches y bienvenidos. I am honored to join you and share in this momentous occasion. As we begin, we acknowledge that the grounds upon which our university stands are inextricably tied to the history and culture of indigenous peoples. We pay our respect to elders past, present, and future and to those who have stewarded this land throughout the generations. The University of Northern Colorado occupies the lands in the territories of the Ute, Cheyenne, and Arapaho peoples. Further, we acknowledge the 48 tribes that are historically tied to the state of Colorado. I challenge us to be better stewards of the land we inhabit, as well as learn the stories and practices of indigenous peoples' history and culture. Graduates, tonight marks a significant milestone on your journey as a lifelong learner. As president, I am honored to be among the first to share my congratulations, to recognize you, and to celebrate your success. Commencement is one of my favorite university events. It is a time for celebration, 
and a time to remember. It is a day to, and I cannot stress this enough, take lots of photos and videos. So graduates, I know this contradicts what you've heard in class, but do not be shy about using your phone today. Take selfies throughout the ceremony and post to social media with the hashtag UNC Bear Grad. In fact, I'm going to take a selfie right now. So with all the graduates who are able, please stand up. Please stand up. Can you, get, can you folks get a little closer together in the middle there? <laughs> Scoot in a little bit. There you go. Keep going. Come on. You can do that. Come on. In. All right. All right. Perfect. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Please be seated. In all seriousness, please capture and share your favorite moments from today's celebration. I want you to leave here able to remember the deep sense of accomplishment that only comes when we achieve a monumental goal. And a big goal takes a big team. Will our parents, family members, and supporters in attendance please rise and be recognized? Thank you. And thank you for sharing in UNC's commitment to student success. This is a team effort, and we appreciate your contributions. Graduates, you have heard me speak often about our commitment to student success, and that commitment begins with our trustees, who place your educational attainment at the center of all that we do. Will the trustees with us this evening please stand to be recognized, including trustees Janice Sinden, Dr. Steve Jordan, faculty trustee Dr. Fritz Fisher, and student trustee Malika Michelle Fuller. Thank you for joining today's celebration. And thank you also to the dedicated staff, faculty, and university leaders who make transformative education possible at UNC. Will our university staff, faculty, and leaders please stand and be recognized? Thank you. We have many veterans, active duty military personnel, and military family members with us today. Please stand if you are an active duty or a veteran. Thank you. On behalf of UNC, thank you for your service to our country. Graduates, you are a part of a noble tradition that dates back to 1891 when our institution celebrated commencement for the first 12 graduates. Since then, more than 154,000 individuals have graduated from our university. We are honored to have you be counted among this esteemed group and excited to celebrate in your success. Among you this evening are 332 graduates earning 272 master's degrees 37 doctorates, and 23 specialist degrees. You range in age from 22 to 66 years old. Our fall graduating class represents 45 Colorado counties, 42 states, and 10 countries in addition to the United States.
you reflect the rich diversity that makes our nation and our university strong. And today is about celebrating what makes you individually and collectively an impressive group of graduates. With many of our students being the first in their family to attend college, today is about celebrating the individuals who will soon become the first in their families to earn an advanced degree. As a Carnegie Classified Engage campus, today is a celebration for the students whose commitment to education is matched by their commitment to community. As a university where nearly a quarter of our undergraduate students identify as Latinx, today is about celebrating all those who proudly say, si sí, se puede, yes we can, because you can and you did. Today is about celebrating the future educators, artists, scientists, business leaders, healthcare professionals, and others who graduate from our nationally recognized programs ready to enter careers as leaders and innovators. As you enjoy today's ceremony and the celebrations that will surely follow, I want you to remember the sense of accomplishment and excitement that you feel right now. It may be mixed with nervousness or anticipation, and that is okay. What is important is that you remember what it feels like to succeed in what you set out to achieve. You will certainly face challenges and bumps along your path in life, but I know that when you set out to achieve a goal, whether it is attaining a UNC degree, advancing in your career, or advocating for your change in your community, you will succeed. The path to success may not always be clear, so remember why you started and what it feels like to succeed. What it feels like today, in this moment. Use today's feeling of accomplishment to fuel your drive toward your next goal in life. And if the feeling starts to fade, I want you to look back on your graduation group selfie and know that UNC will always be here to help you and to celebrate your success. After all, once a bear, always a bear. Congratulations, UNC graduates. Good evening. My name is Mark Anderson, and I'm Senior Vice President for Academic Affairs and Provost for the University of Northern Colorado. I'd like to first welcome the families and guests and friends of our graduate, and thank you for coming and celebrating with us this evening. I'd also like to acknowledge and congratulate our graduates. Earning a, a, a master's degree, a specialist, or a doctoral degree is, is quite an accomplishment, and you are to be celebrated and acknowledged. Many of the traditions associated with commencement is the presentation of the mace and college banners during the processional. These items symbolize the graduates' accomplishments and the university's commitment to student success. The selection of the banner bearer is considered to be a special honor. Those serving as banner bearers today have been recognized and selected by their colleges based upon their academic contributions. Would our mace and banner bearers please stand and be recognized? In addition, we acknowledge the commencement marshals, deputy marshals, and marshal captains who serve as leaders during these ceremonies. Would these faculty members please stand and be recognized? Thank you. Faculty members are fundamental to the success of students and to the university. Daily, these scholars and educators demonstrate a passion for superior teaching, and they foster the students' intellectual growth through research and their creative activities. Faculty members, would you once again stand and be recognized so we can celebrate your many contributions to the university? Thank you. The laws of the state of Colorado vest the authority for the University of Northern Colorado and its board of trustees. We are pleased to have trustee Dr. Steve Jordan here to give the authorization for conferring of the degrees. Dr. Jordan.
Thank you, Dr. Anderson. First, on behalf of the Board of Trustees, it is my privilege to congratulate the graduates and to their families as well. This is a momentous occasion, and each and every one of us are proud of your academic accomplishments here tonight. The Board would also like to express its appreciation to the faculty and the staff for the way you have guided these students to this moment in their academic career. We truly appreciate all the work you have put into their success. President Feinstein, by virtue of the authority vested in the Board of Trustees for the University of Northern Colorado, and as a member of the Board, I hereby authorize you to confer on this term's graduates the appropriate degrees as recommended by the faculty of the university. Thank you, Trustee Jordan, and thank you very much for your tremendous service and support to UNC. My name is Cindy Wesley, and I am the interim dean of the graduate school. Will the candidates for the master's degree please rise? President Feinstein, these candidates have met the requirements for the Master's of Arts, Master of Arts in Teaching, Master of Music, Master of Science, Master of Biological Science, Master of Public Health, Master of Business Administration, Master of Accountancy, and Professional Science Master's Degrees. The faculty recommends them to you for the conferring of these degrees. By the virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees, and upon the recommendation of the faculty, I confer upon each of you the appropriate master's degrees to which you are entitled to with all of the rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining to these degrees. Thank you, students. Please be seated for a moment. The deans of their respective colleges will now present the graduates who have met the requirements for the degrees established and recommended by their college's faculty. Hello, my name is Eugene Sheehan, Dean of the College of Education and Behavioral Sciences. Well, the candidates receiving Master of Arts, uh, Master of Arts in Teaching, and Master of Science degrees from the College of Education and Behavioral Sciences Please come forward to receive your diplomas. David Bedinger. Nina Endler. Idilio Monseves Pinedo. Jennifer Loebs. Nuri Marakshi. Troy Shu. Katie Polder. Carly Arguello. Parima Reguentan. Brittany Popelka. Ivan Colin. Ryan Ramsey. Hannah Fuss. Patrick Call. Michelle Green. Juanita Hall. Cindy Gonzalez. 
Craig Klingenberg. Candice Dow. James Kuhn. Ellen Price Olivson. Stacy Nichols. Sunny Zeng. Kumar Singh. Nancy Curzon. Mackenzie Kaler. Jamie Klein. Jordan Frotz. Julie Bledsoe. Katie Franick. Kelsey Hennig. Jacqueline Moody. Katie Gay. Adriana Diaz. Emily Allison. Alina Clouse. Erin Thompson. Hannah Spledlow. Courtney Fisher. Janae McCarty. Francesca Lowry. Lynette Lucero. Haley Davis. Ashley Runyon. Rochelle Talbot. Ethan Emery. Kimberly Hayward. Whitney White. Sarah Bukowski. Anna Williams. Leah Herrera. Hadi Alarmer. Belal Al Said. Amanda Raim. Megan Johnson. Callie Reza. Lauren Curtis. Lindsay Schwartz. Michelle Davis Fick. Rachel Tracy. Gidget Brubaker. Morgan Keith. Anne Longacre. Melanie Butler. Kyle Mills. Megan Weaver. Kathleen Tavenier. Sean McNames. Brittany Kruger. Hannah Carmichael. Aspen Walker. Celia Nutting. Stacy Smith Letford. Aaron Havens. Anne Ernest. Catherine Sexton. Jenny Hatch. Julie Price. Heidi. Guy Hayes. Emily Lind. Janine Peralta. Courtney Carson. Tracy Trowbridge. Jody Green. Brianna Garcia. Shannon Lindsay. Valerie. Cruz. Ellen Cooper. Alyssa Woodward. Leslie Loya. May Mashur Al Rauki. Emily Clark. Kimberly Britton. Mercedes Carpenter. Laura Farber. Thank you. 
Jaina Ryan. Krista Nowart. Marissa Bevington. Lauren May. Heather Bloch. Connie Shackelford. James Mock. Teresa Butterfield. Patricia Texter. Kirsten Essien. Amanda Bolster. Brienne Scott. Raiden Giannopoulos. Alicia Mueller. Jenna Dakenai. Joanna Fedor. Jennifer Culkin. Kimberly Wagner. Kenneth Rankin. Michael Canono. Emily Wayson. Carrie James. Tessa O'Brien. Lauren Wibbles. Michelle Mawinney. Kara Ryman. Gabriella Eckert. Stephanie Allison. Robin Medina. Tammy Culver. Pip Pryor. Kirsten Riley. Shelby Smith. Julie Ahrens. Cheyenne Rood. Ashley Arias. Ariana Eigner. Olivia Gallegos. Allison Kircher. Caitlin Doris. Megan Gallegos. Myshoa Bang. Alice Preston. Sierra Hines. Fanny Owusu Achampong. Go Chang. Sun Yu. Lita Melman. <laughs> Melissa Steinbrin. <laughs> Elise Lauerman. Hi everyone, my name is Laura Connolly. I am Dean of the College of Humanities and Social Sciences. Well, the candidates for Master of Arts and Master of Arts in Teaching from the College of Humanities and Social Sciences, please come forward to receive your diplomas. Joshua Mond. Yeah. 
Shyla Mars. Jeanette Rodriguez. Caitlin Ortis. Araceli Flores. Gianna Stover. Jennifer Bekay. Hannah Connor. Vanessa Ariano. Kayla Brewster. Kitsia Cordova. Brittany Brewster. Nate Medina. Adriana Cortez Mantilla. Good evening. My name is Paul Bobrowski, Dean of the Monfort College of Business. Will the candidates receiving Master of Accountancy and Master of Business Administration degrees from the Monfort College of Business please come forward to receive your diplomas. Shank. Alan Ibarra. Abby Bruins. Crystal Cano. Hannah Pfeiffer. Good evening. My name is Burkhard Englert, the Dean of the College of Natural Health Sciences. Will the candidates receiving Master of Arts, Master of Science, Master of Arts in Teaching, Master of Biological Science, Master of Public Health, and Professional Science Master's degrees from the College of Natural and Health Sciences please come forward to receive your diplomas. Victoria Roberts. Caitlin Logan. Jade Koretko. Brian Johnson, Dean's Citation for Excellence. Samara Weber. Douglas Petty. Gobinda Nupani. Ashley. Campanella. David D'Souza. Jacqueline Hamlin. Marissa Flores. Christine Williams. Paulina Gonzalez. Eileen Vlamish. Lucas Wilbur. Catherine Manter. Kaylee Garcia. Steven Mesa. Evan Johnson. Desiree Whitehead. Zach Henning. Alex Mead. Jordan Sparks. Steph Evil Sizer. Dylan Sanchez. Caleb 
their song. Chauncey Williams. Adele Alani, Dean Citation for Outstanding Thesis. Sarah Johnson. Margaret Bryson. Emily Davis. Erin Anderson. Tian Wei. Wei Tian. Janice Gabriel. Grace Hudkins. Lindsay Welsh. Hello. I am Kiki Gilderhus, Interim Dean of the College of Performing and Visual Arts. I know that the candidates receiving Masters of Arts and Masters of Music degrees from the College of Performing and Visual Arts are coming forward, receiving their diplomas. Chad Knapp. Yishen Chen, Chen Yishen. Karen Daira. Yao Lu, Lu Yao. Elizabeth Brennan. Kaylee Morrison. Teresa Schmidt. Maria Ross Campsey. Taylor Kath. <laughs> Lauren Seibel. Caitlin Diner. Katrina Gorley. Alana Kava. Martin Rodriguez. And Lauren Wasser. Will the candidates for a specialist in education degree please stand? President Feinstein, these candidates meet the degree requirements for the specialist in education degree. The faculty recommends them to you for the conferring of the degree. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees and upon the recommendation of the faculty, I confer upon each of you the appropriate specialist degree to which you are entitled to with all of the rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining to these degrees. Will the specialist in education degree candidates please come forward to receive your diplomas. Susan Knuckle. Mary Hulak. Danielle Schweitzer. Josh Wainscott. Will 
the candidates for doctoral degrees. Please stand. <laughs> President Feinstein, these candidates meet the requirements for the Doctor of Arts, Doctor of Audiology, Doctor of Education, Doctor of Philosophy, and Doctor of Nursing Practice degrees. The faculty recommends them to you for the conferring of these degrees. By the virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees and upon the recommendation of the faculty, I confer upon each of you the appropriate doctoral degrees to which you are entitled with all of the rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining to these degrees. Will the doctoral degree candidates please come forward to be hooded by your research advisors and college deans? Erin Henderson. Erin Henderson's major is Counselor Education and Supervision. Dr. Henderson is being hooded by Research Professor Dr. Helm. Anne Elizabeth Nash, Dean Citation for Excellence. Anne Elizabeth Nash's major is Biological Education. Dr. Nash is being hooded by Research Professor Dr. Mackesy. Jenna Mack. Jenna Mack's major is Counselor Education and Supervision. Dr. Mack is being hooded by her research professor, Dr. Helm. Amani Abdugadar. Armani Abdugadar's major is Chemical Education. Abdugadar is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Suits. Jessica Manson. Jessica Manson's major is Counselor Education and Supervision. Dr. Manson is being hooded by her research professor, Dr. Helm. Elizabeth Scott Janda. Elizabeth Scott Janda's major is Educational Mathematics. Dr. Scott Janda is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Powers. Jessica Hopkins. Jessica Hopkins' major is Counselor Education and Supervision. Dr. Hopkins is being hooded by the research professor, Dr. Very Busy Helm. Nikki Armstrong. Nikki Armstrong's major is Nursing. Dr. Armstrong is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Dunham. Catherine Jarnot. Catherine Jarnot's major is Educational Leadership. Dr. Jarnot is being hooded by her research professor, Dr. Vogel. Karen Alexander. Karen Alexander's major is Nursing, Family Nurse Practitioner. Dr. Alexander is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Dunham. Miguel Salinas. Miguel Salinas' major is Educational Leadership. Dr. Salinas is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Vogel. Catherine Casey. Catherine Casey's major is Nursing Education. Dr. Casey is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Dunham. Louise Benke. Louise Benke's major is Educational Psychology. Dr. Benke is being hooded by research professors Dr. Pugh and Dr. Erickson. Hannah Brumbaugh. Hannah Brumbaugh's major is Nursing Family Nurse Practitioner. Dr. Brumbaugh is being hooded by research professor Dr. Henley. Yeah. 
Selene Flores. Selene Flores' major is educational psychology. Dr. Flores is being wooded by research professor Dr. Pugh. Mackenzie Kemper. Mackenzie Kemper's major is nursing, family nurse practitioner. Dr. Kemper is being hooded by research professor Dr. Einlig. Mackenzie Peak Poya. Mackenzie Peak Poya's major is educational psychology. Dr. Peak Poya is being hooded by research professor Dr. Peterson. Angela Peckerell. Angela Peckerell's major is nursing, family nurse practitioner. Dr. Peckerell is being hooded by research professor Dr. Henry. Zachary Clancy. Dr. Clancy's major is educational studies. He's being hooded by research professor Dr. Hardy. Sapana Shakaya. Sapana Shakaya's major is nursing, family nurse practitioner. Dr. Shakaya is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Henry. Ryan Katz. Ryan Katz's major is educational studies. Dr. Katz is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Harding. Ernie Roosley. Ernie Roosley's major is nursing, family nurse practitioner. Dr. Roosley is being hooded by research professor, Dr. McNeil. Rachel Christensen. Rachel Christensen's major is higher education and student affairs leadership. Dr. Christensen's being hooded by research professor, Dr. Birnbaum. Otto Butchultz. Otto Butchultz's major is sport and exercise science, biomechanics. Dr. Butchultz is being hooded by research professors, Dr. Heiss and Dr. Smith. Andrea DeCosmo. Andrea DeCosmo's major is higher education and student affairs leadership. Dr. DeCosmo is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Birnbaum. Shane Murphy. Shane Murphy's major is sport and exercise science, biomechanics. Dr. Murphy is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Smith. Rebecca Wolf. Rebecca Wolf's major is higher education and student affairs leadership. Dr. Wolf is being hooded by her research professor, Dr. Birnbaum. Aaron Patchett, Dean Citation for Excellence and Outstanding Dissertation. Aaron Patchett's major is sport and exercise science, sport administration. Dr. Patchett is being hooded by research professor, Dr. O.J. Andrew Lale. Andrew Lale's major is higher education and student affairs leadership. Dr. Lale's being hooded by his research professor, Dr. Lee. Ann Kuhn. Ann Kuhn's major is sport and exercise science, sport pedagogy. Dr. Kuhn is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Dunhauer. Shergene Lindsay. Shergene Lindsay's major is higher education and student affairs leadership. Dr. Lindsay is being hooded by a research professor, Dr. Yakubowski. Todd Swingle. Todd Swingle's major is music, music composition. Dr. Swingle is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Riddick. Hong Fanye DeWald. Hong Fanye DeWald's major is special education. Dr. Fanye DeWald is being hooded by her research professor, Dr. Farrell. Michael Kilcoyne. Michael Kilcoyne's major is music, music performance. Dr. Kilcoyne is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Maldi. <laughs> Austin Ross Brown. Austin Brown's major is Applied Statistics and Research Methods. Dr. Brown is being hooded by research professor, Dr. Lalonde.
Graduates, let's look back on a few highlights from the past year. <laughs> That was great. The graduating class of 1910 left as a gift to the university an entry gate on 10th Avenue, which is inscribed with the motto, rowing, not drifting. This resonates with me as a powerful, relevant metaphor, a reminder to be purposeful. As you leave here today, I hope you will take time to reflect on the rowing, the rowing that you have done to earn your degree. And I encourage you to be fearless rowers in all of your pursuits, no matter the direction you take from here. I also encourage you to remain connected to your alma mater. UNC is stronger because of you and with you. As graduates, you join a network of more than 134,000 living alumni worldwide. Use your bare network and put it to work as you seek a career change, find a new place to call home, or look for ways to stay connected to UNC. Will everyone who is a UNC alum please stand? That includes all graduates, by the way. So look around you graduates. These individuals are your bare network. This network is a tremendous resource that will always be there for you. So don't forget, once a bear, always a bear, that's right. Thank you, please be seated. It is an age old custom in cultures around the world to announce important events with the ringing of bells. School bells beckon students to come together for a new day of learning. The chimes in our own Gunter Hall mark the beginning of this commencement ceremony. Graduates, as I think you've already know, under your chairs, you'll find a memento which represents a school bell. Please join me in celebrating your achievement. That's great. So, I, you can stop ringing the bells now, I think. Thank you. So in just a moment, UNC's graduate brass quintet will perform the recessional. Will the audience, graduates, and faculty please remain seated until the stage party exits and you are dismissed by the commencement marshals. Once dismissed, I encourage our graduates and guests to remain and take photos to celebrate and remember today. Congratulations, graduates. I declare the fall 2019 graduate commencement at a close. Thank you.